da, da, da. Time for your almost said October December read of this current year. Yay! Capricorn, this is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Check your charts. If this resonates with you, good deal. If not, do not worry about it. After all, you just boop your nose and away it goes. There's no point in like lingering on shit that has nothing to do with you, right? Right. Cross Roger switch where you need to because I have no idea what the hell is going on. And if you do not appreciate my offensive language because I like F-bombs and other such things, please find somebody else who enjoys the way you want them to speak. Because, you know, I, I, I like saying I like dirty words because I'm a dirty girl, right? Right. Newcomers, if you want a personal read, all the information is down below in the description box after the listing of the music I use for the background. Right? Right. First reading's on the house. Everything else comes with the price, and I do accept tips and donations. Thank you very kindly in advance. Mm-hmm. All right, caps. Something's not working. Or something isn't working, either your guides, or you feel like something isn't working out, like that energy. However, the situation is the Page of Cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, somebody coming in with like very timid but genuine emotion, it's expression. Wants and wishes you want to play some games? <laughs> what? <laughs> Capricorns, what the fuck is this Jake shit right here? What you doing? Huh? What are you doing? Well, Capricorn, Cross Watcher, of course. But someone here wants to play some fucking head games. I don't know who it is. Definitely some sword energy. Definitely someone playing with, like, a sword fighting contest with dicks, but you know, happens. Obstacles and challenges, analyzing shit, like looking. It's where it goes, card. It's analyzing for sure, but it's like someone's gotta stay in the dark before they figure things out. They got their dead fish Fred. Or dead fish named Fred. Technically, yeah, that would be the same fish because he looks dead too, but he's got a little star. I don't know, but someone's got a dead fish with him trying to figure shit out. Being like, what do I do? Um, creature of the fucking ocean. And it, it's just dead. It's, it's been sitting there for like three weeks. And it's just like, you stink. You need a bath. But you never bathe it. And mind you, you're naked too. Or someone's naked. Whoever. Fears and rejections, not being able to get out of a bad situation. You are on the right path. You just don't know where the fuck you're going. You might run into a tree or two, right? And how this shit starts, how it'll end, is an energy of wanting to end things, right? We got the world, which is Saturn's card. So it does have your energy in it, Capricorn. It's a new cycle or you're ending one. But you're looking back at all this shit like, you know what? I want to do something new. At least that's how that's feeling right now. Like you're looking for something new. Or something new's coming your way. But I feel like it's got something to do with these games. And I don't know if I like it yet or not. So we're going to see. It's like someone's sticking their tongue out at this shit not working. That's like weirding me out a little bit. Huh. Interesting. Anyway. Caps. Let's see what's going on with ya. Got you, Aquarius, Pisces, and then I'm fucking done. This is like actually the fastest I've ever done these, so I'm probably wrong in all of them, but it's whatever. We all make mistakes. There might be a resurrection here. For sure. What is this here? Something didn't work, but now it's being resurrected. Someone could go back, but they're definitely looking at the Phoenix for this resurrection, too. But it feels like they're not waiting for anything that's fruitful. Like, whoever this is, Capricorn and Crosswatcher, someone feels like there's something not there, but it's there. They just don't know it? What? Okay, whatever. Anyway, the situation with this Page of Cups, right? Her Hermit, once again, someone's got to look really, really close at shit in order to go and say what they need to say. And that'll bring a slow but sure offering. Oh my dear God. Okay, so caps. Um, hmm. It's like you're waiting for someone to come up and say something to you so you can give them something. 
Like you're trying to look deep inside to figure it out too. It's like you're hoping someone will just run up and be like, la la la, these are my feelings. And then you could be like, I've been holding on to this pentacle forever, please take it, dick it right on my horse. You know, or we can save a horse and ride a cowboy. Hint, ha hint, wink, wink, you know. I feel like there's, hmm, what are you doing, Capricorns? Or who's doing something to you? Hmm, what is this nonsense that it is before my eyes? Five of swords and the wants and wishes. Oh, okay, well, you know. There might be a victory for a bitter empress. It could be a Libra, Taurus, Aries, but someone's getting the victory even though they're a little bit bitter about shit. Someone might get away with some sneaky stuff. Possibly idolizing somebody, but it, it, they gotta throw their fucking justice out the window. It's like bad karma, but... It's like someone's trying to get away from somebody who is um, idolizing them, Capricorns and Cross Watchers. But it's like that's not the right thing to do. It's like trying to get away in order to end this, I think, ideation or this adoration for somebody. But it's not going to work the way they think it is. It's an injustice. That's weird. Down below in the obstacle and challenge, the hermit who's looking over here, right? Someone's just tying themselves. They keep seeing... Okay... That's another sword, but here it's like someone's like, it's like someone's seeing something that they that's bad, but it's wrong. It's like I'm looking for the wrong kind of information to make a bad choice. Oh lord! And that's leaving this person, whoever it is, Capricorn Cross Watcher, feeling like they don't know what the right signal. It's like mixed signals. That's what I'm getting. It's mixed signals because, like, like someone's trying to cut off their feelings for another person but it's not going to work and it's not justified to do so someone's waiting for some words of of uh, passion with this knight of swords to come in with affection and it's like that way they can get rid of this offer it's like there's a reprisal or a resurrection here and the phoenix is right there but someone isn't expecting something because they think it's not working for them and like ah uh, and i'm in this shit fuck God damn it, I hate when I show up in my own shit. I'm sorry, this is something that just sprung up and, and now I get the message and it's just like, God damn it. This is mixed signals. And fears and rejections. You have no idea where you're going with this cup on your horse. Capricorns and cross watchers alike, it's just kind of like, who am I supposed to give this to? Because it tastes delicious. Yeah. But you or them might be ignoring their intuition. And it could be a Pisces. Could be a Pisces involved or someone just um, having that energy or whatnot, right? What the fuck was that? Oh. All of this just... Okay, the one I was looking at is totally lost now. That's okay. Um, you know, it's like no matter how far you go, you're still going to miss the boat. And like it's like trying to ignore reality oop there go gravity oop i i i really need to listen to that song because i need to find the rest of the words but it's like someone missed the boat and it's like they can't escape reality what the fuck okay Another, uh, it's more pisces energy someone feels like they're stuck as a martyr not knowing what the fuck to do. There's a lot of water in here, caps and cross watchers. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay. Oh, uh, the tangled webs we weave. All right. How this shit starts, how it'll end. Full circle card, right? You might want to end things because you feel like there's no love being displayed, but you are being watched. And then secrets come out with the fucking mm. <laughs> all this fucking water. Mm. I'm just saying, I don't like emotions. They bring out something in me that just makes me really uncomfortable. But that's my own problem because that's a fear that I've developed on my own. Becky's got her back turned. Water sign. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, Mikey's got her back turned, but there is a cycle coming. God damn it. Probably going to be a disaster. <laughs> or it's just going to be that action pack. One of the two. Fucking Christ. Oh my. Okay. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I promise. I'm just having an existential crisis in my head because this is way too close to home for me. Anyway. How about your energy? Yeah, that's what you get for messing with my fucking light, you stupid stink bug. Get the hell out of my house. This is my house. Anyway, it's the energy for y'all guys, right? You don't have any control in this situation. That's not like over control to me. That's like you don't have any control. Or someone's being a colossal dick, but we don't know until we get there, right? But I feel like this is a lack of control, not someone trying to control everything. But if you are kind of going through that Capricorns and Cross Watchers, like you have none at all. No power whatsoever. Um, and it makes you feel like you just have to leave. Or someone's going to leave you. Because they don't have the control. Or you have to walk away impulsively because you don't know what the fuck you're doing. You know, could be that too. One more, please. And then someone comes and saves the f mm, Okay, okay. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. Someone just comes and saves the day. After it feels like everything is, you know, gone to waste. Down in the situation. Hmm. I'm annoyed. <laughs> Someone's just losing their shit and just trying to cut things out. But they can't. They can't let it go. They can't let it go. Three for you all, because I'm just that nosy. So they might just go get drunk and then ride in on their fucking horse, dragging it along, just being like, hey, so my owner is kind of fucked up here. Do you mind giving them a hand? You know? Wants and wishes. Ah, uh, someone you might have to give something to a gnome. Make him feel better. But you might fuck that up anyway, so you know. And that's gonna probably haunt you for a little bit. <laughs> Oh, Capricorns and Cross Watchers. Dear Lord. Yeah, so feelings aren't our MO for sure. Capricorn, you might try to give something to somebody. Either you or your person fucks up the emotions and then you're sitting there like, this was the stupidest shit ever. Now I'm going to be living and sleeping with this anxiety for like the next three weeks. What the fuck was I thinking? Right? might open your eyes a little bit though it might help you see something you didn't see before like the fact that you were high and you picked up a fucking snake and now there's a black bo dog chasing you in a circle trying to get to it and you're just like oh my god what the fuck is going on you know obstacles and challenges capricorns and cross watchers oh what is this two cups What? God, fuck. Okay. Your obstacle and challenge, Capricorn, after all of this, you end up hugging some, embracing a new person. You know, taking your time with your harvest as you start a new journey on this fool's journey, taking a leap of faith. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like this one bit because it's just like, uh <sighs> Fucking emotions. I swear to Christ. Like, you're so annoying. They don't make any sense. That's my Aquarius moon talking. And it's just like, I, uh, like, this is a lot of stress. Like, I'm not telling y'all my situation. I'm just saying. I'm greatly annoyed with how things go. It's like... 
Still been fucking world. I don't know. I like that's just how I feel right now. That's all. Because it's just like Jesus fucking Christ with all of this dramatics and such. Yeah. Uh, here's your rejections. Things actually will work out. It's just gonna take some looking at. Once again, you you have to actually look things over in order to figure them out, Capricorns. You know. Um you might have to be a little bit gentle, or someone's gonna be gentle with you. Could be a fire sign. But things will work out. But it's like there's not going to be. It's like you agree to disagree with somebody. Hmm. Which is definitely no. Like, there's definitely a coming together thing, but when it comes to delegations, it's like, no, everyone agrees to disagree. But it's not in, like, a really hostile way. I'll drop another one on that, because I'm curious. Mm, okay. You play to self. You know, like, I'm, I'm hearing that. Capricorns. I feel like if you try to discuss something that you can't agree with somebody on, it's just, you're just stick, gonna end up sticking your foot in your own mouth. So it's like, it's kind of like better not to say anything at all, almost. Did a card just flip on me? I guess not, I don't see it now. Alright, final card, Capricorns. Because apparently the shadow period is just here. Let's see. Um, you're sitting there looking on your phone, waiting, just being like, are they ever going to text me? Even though you could probably text them, could be cancer, right? You know, having a hard time letting this shit go, being like, you know, like, I know it's over. I know it was supposed to be dead like 450 years ago, but just give me like five minutes. I can get another thing on Kino. You can't take your Kino winnings with you. I know I can't, but I still like to play the game, you know? So the wheel is turning here towards your happiness. Okay, the actual fuck. What? Okay, so let me get this straight. Um, whoever the fuck it is I'm channeling right now. It feels like something's going to end. There's no love. People are watching you, and then secrets come out. Uh, you've been sitting there looking at your phone, waiting for something, feeling like you know, like you might as well end it because you're just dragging shit on. And then the wheel turns, and then you get your happily ever after. After all, well, so this was your reading, Capricorns, because like I'm totally, absolutely livid right now. Anyway, um, if you enjoyed this, please like, share, it, and subscribe. You don't have to. And I don't blame you, but I greatly appreciate it. I'm going to go um, smoke a cigarette because I'm angry a little bit and slightly, slightly disappointed I showed up this time. Um, I love your guys' faces. You all have a good night, possibly better than I will, and I will see you later. Bye-byes.